Popular media personality Toka Mackinwa slammed the troll who accused her of slipping away to the top. The OAP posted a lengthy rant on a Twitter page about how young people starting out have an entitlement mentality. The media personality wrote that it breaks her heart to see a lot of talented people try to cut corners on the way to success. Mackinwa noted that the way to success requires a lot of sacrifice and hard work. The troll saw the post as the perfect opportunity to accuse the media personality of trying to be a motivational speaker, whereas she slept away to the top. Mackinwa wasn't prepared to let the slander slide as she replied that if slipping one's way to the top is so easy, then she can also do the same. Mm -hmm. I, I feel like when people see, or men in general, they see a very successful woman, they tend to make that statement, especially when she's not in a relationship or marriage is she slept with this person or this person is funding her or this is this this person is giving her money or she has a man behind her success that's why like the statement is very 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 disgusting to me in person like and yes even if she's sleeping around you do it do it and come and give your own story how about that because i don't even think it's so easy for a lot of people to sleep around because they are like complications you hear stories oe beta the side chick, he did this, he did that. So you, how about you do it and you become talking about Kimwa? Yeah, yeah. I totally agree with that. I think um, a lot of people tend to judge, you know, yes, women, women from their success and they just feel like, Especially oh, every when successful single. woman. Yeah, every success. And Toke Makinwa was a single all alone. You know, somebody else, um, somebody was talking about... Yeah, I think we we're actually talking about you this morning and all that. And somebody said, Ah, she should be token marking one. And I was like, <laughs> and I was like, hey, what do you mean? Say, token marking one. Token marking one gets small sense now. Nah, you get. And she was like, Ah, you were like, No, 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 it's not about that. I said, No, token marking one is like a regular girl. And, and I'm yes, like, I'm No. Like, what, but look, so this girl hates? made millions from her book. From exactly. her breakup she, in a marriage, from a divorce sense, in a marriage. Like she's yeah. very I like her in general. Girl. She's the whole package. So mm. I don't know. People should stop hating. Because yeah. even even single mothers, you see it, oh, they don't have uh, maybe they broke up with their husband or they left their husband to steal his money. There's just always a story when the woman is single and making it. Like and it's very, very, very annoying. Mm. Very it annoying. Is, it and it's really very hard annoying. for women to Okay, and even if even if her a boyfriend is helping her out in her career, is is your partner not supposed to help you? Is he supposed to look at you and leave you stagnant or what? Like people should be realistic. See, somebody made a valid point with this your state of mind and um I, you know I said it yesterday what state of mind? that is myopic and um I think you should get off what your high of horses mind? of saying, look, the pressure the society what? is putting a lot of pressure on men that's, that's, That was already. never my point. That hold was up, my point. hold up, on that's men already. The fact that we choose to be providers. You didn't, you didn't, uh, huh? You don't, you, what are you saying? Choose? You don't choose anything. Is it not in the Bible? When you people want to say women are supposed to cook and clean, you oh, can't cook. Okay, okay. You can't cook by but, but, but you, you, you want to deny your are role. You, you want to deny your are role, you please. Yes, I am. But when you so what are you talking about? Equality. Equality. Yes, equality. See, a lot of men. You're contradicting yourself. Man. When you want to when you want to talk about women or oh, not being able to I'm cook and clean. Myself. Women must see, cook and clean. You guys know how to cook the Bible. Not, but your role see, from the Bible is to be a provider. That's not even what I was. That's not my try and understand. Marriage is not a poverty elevation plan. All this thing of uh, Do you know what you're lacking here? Cannot... What you're lacking here is understanding of my point. If she's with somebody and the person wants to help her career, what's what's bad there? What's your point? Like, so you should not help her help career. Your career by yourself. What Don't are you saying? She's obviously going you to be. You can get a man to do. You see, oh my a man goodness! Don't make it look oh like my it is God! A man's... Wow. See, guy. So I'm if you're in a relationship with, with a you. woman that can help your career she shouldn't help it of course she exactly. should exactly so what is your point my, my point exactly because i'm using man always, I, i'm not dating always, a woman so why always, would i you're say you're always man? making reference to oh you little man uh, i uh, never uh, yesterday when i made my statements i said a hard-working woman and how can i be hard-working making a lot of money i have to date somebody that meets up to my payroll 
So what are you saying? Well, I'm just trying to let you know. No, I'm, I'm not being dependent on a on man. If I'm trying, I'm trying to make to a lot of money, no, you're not trying to school me on when anything. Anybody if you're trying. independent, you're making your own money, doing everything you want to do, being able to afford everything you want to, I can decide to date a man that meets up to that amount. His payroll meets up to mine. A relationship or higher. is not a poverty elevation plan. That's All right. Final. But that's not according my point. According to Charles Okwaleke, the story, um, according to Charles Okwaleke, we should in a new movie, um, which will be, um, which st um, is based on an event of October 25th, 1993. Play Network Studios is developing a film set to follow the striking events of October 25th, 1993. That's all four teenage boys hijack a Nigerian Airways plane as a medium of protest against the June 12 elections. Confirming the report, the film production studio's boss Charles Okpalike took to Instagram with details um, of the forthcoming project in line with our commitment to tell our Nigerian stories. My research and writing team at the Play Networks have been working on an amazing storyline for a few months now that is centered around the 1993 hijack of the Nigerian Airways, Okpalike wrote. This was in an attempt to force the government to hand over power to MK or Abiola following the failed June 12 election. The young men were eventually captured and spent nine years and four months in jail in the army that's an amazing story right there because i don't know um i'm glad to say i was alive then and then yes i remember the story a lot when you know they they um I jacked the plane and I remember the tension in the country then and I remember some were cheering them on, some were egging them on like, yeah, you guys do this, you guys do this because everybody wanted MK Abiola to win so badly. Yeah, so I don't know. What's your take on the story? Um, I feel like it's good they're making something out of this, trying to teach people that weren't there to express this, mm. everything that happened. So yeah, it's nice and it's amazing. It's to be an amazing movie. Yeah, good storyline too. Exactly. Good story